What's up my darlings? Welcome back to Mass Effect 3. So today is a big day. We're doing Priority Rannoch. I'm really nervous. I wasn't sure how much more I had to do before doing the next story mission and it looks like we're going to just turn some stuff into the Citadel and then we'll be off. I don't know much, but I know that this is a big one. A lot of you have been really anticipating this. We have supposedly found the Reaper base that's controlling the Geth, and apparently we're going to destroy it. But Legion and the Corians have different plans. I'm sure it's going to be wild. <sighs> Deep breaths, grab yourself a drink or a snack, get cozy, and let's get to it. I'm gonna have some time to warm up because we're going to the Citadel first. But inside, I'm screaming. <laughs> it's a big day today. As usual, the fate of the universe is entirely in my hands. I have to be a diplomat, a soldier, and everything. I mean, thankfully, I get to decompress before this mission by wreaking havoc on the Citadel, which is a really nice way to relax just tormenting the people of the Citadel who are minding their own business. Some people meditate, some people read. I choose to run around on the Citadel and bug people and listen in on their conversations. And then we have some stuff to do with the Quarians and the Geth. I don't think I'm ever going to be fully ready for this, so we may as well just get right to it. All right, my darlings, let's get back into it and boop that any button. Boop. Me? Yes, I forgot last time I ended in front of my glorious fish tank. Who else in the universe has this magnificent of a fish tank in their room? Look at the jellyfish. If you're also feeling anxious about today's mission and how things are going to transpire, I invite you to gaze upon my highly curated, one-of-a-kind fish tank, and take some deep breaths. Ah! <laughs> ah. All right. Now that we've had some relaxation and, you know, flopped down on our bed, had a good cry, listened to some music, binge-watched a show for 12 hours, disappeared from the world for a little bit, we are ready to go to the Citadel and turn in some of those last minute side missions before the main event. Let's get it. Boop. And boop. Wee. Hello, trainer. Hi. Commander. Hi. How are you? Okay, everyone. Uh, Omega was intense, right? I mean, none of you were there, but it was really intense. Today, we're going to the Reaper base that's controlling all the Geth. So if anyone wants to come, you have to get your own ride there because I'm leaving now. <laughs> I'm in a mood today. I don't know who most of you are because I can't talk to you, but we'll probably need all the help we can get. I'm just doing my usual jog around the ship before I go. I've got to jog out some of this anxiety. It's going to be absolutely fine. You know, I have the weight of the entire universe on my shoulders and I don't really know what to do with myself. So this really helps. I'm gonna go talk to Joker really quick and see if he has any encouraging words to say before I go. Hey dude. Commander. Hi. I have a feeling there's gonna be a lot of that today. Hello. How's the ship running, Edie? I am updating the cyber warfare suite around our Reaper IFF. Yay. It should resemble Reaper code exactly. Oh, okay. Sick. Bye kids. Love them. See you later, Hosen. It looks like there's not a ton of conversation to be had, so let's just go to the Citadel and do this. Boop. Well, Arya's ship has pieced out now that she got Omega back, so we're right here. So let's get it. Boop. To the Citadel. Boop. To the Alliance docks. Boop. You're cleared to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? That's an excellent question. I genuinely have no idea where I'm going because I'm turning a bunch of stuff in, but I don't really know where to start. So I wonder how long she would just wait for me to give her an answer. If this was real time, this would be pretty incredible patience on her part. 
I don't know, you know, I'm just gonna be really indecisive. <laughs> She just hears me over the intercom like, well, I don't know, you know, I could go to the embassies, but like, I might want to do a bit of clubbing and go to purgatory. Oh, I do have someone to visit at the hospital. <laughs> Meanwhile, there's like 50 ships behind me doing whatever the ship equivalent of honking is, probably firing a missile at me or something. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to say no and walk because I can't decide. I'll handle it. Yes, Commander. Thank you. Hello everyone, I'm back. Did you miss me? Hello! Hi! Oh. These two. Then consider this a serious assignment. Intel's expecting a Cerberus raid. Oh. Cerberus? Surprise, surprise. Cerberus? They're a problem? I thought we were fighting Reapers, ma'am. Give it a week. You could be. Uh, do you want to be? Because I can tell you firsthand, you definitely don't want to be. Anyways, see you later. Hi. Ah, uh, the Citadel. My favorite place to run around and get up in everybody's business. It's a great time. Hey, what are you guys talking about? That's cool. Hi. How's it going? Ooh, the keeper's following me. I love you. Look at his little backpack. It has an antenna sticking out of it. Presh. Let's take a look at the map really quick. We have, oh, Jacob's in the hospital patient lounge still? Interesting. We have Dr. Cylon in lab services at the hospital. Ari is back in the VIP lounge. Edie and Joker are still in purgatory as well. We have Liara. And then we have James, Tactus, Kelly, Zaid. I feel like we've talked to a lot of these people. So I think I'm going to have to check my journal to see where to turn stuff in. I have to say this is something I don't love about Mass Effect 3 is the journal is really confusing. Like it's not very clear. I just wish there was some kind of little update to tell me I'd found it because it gets it gets a lot. Like the journal gets really cluttered. It would just save me a lot of time to be able to just go to the places where I need to do things. But I guess we're wandering around for a bit, screaming internally. It's fine. Everything's fine. Boop. And boop. Sector status recognized. Please select a destination. Hello again. I haven't missed you at all. Let's just go in order. I'll go to the embassies next. Boop. Thank you. Does anyone have any missions I can turn in? Because my journal's not telling me what I can turn in. So I guess I'll just run around and hope I run into someone. Fun. Love that for me. Hello. <laughs> Your daughter's paperwork has been processed. What? You said it was impossible. How did you- I can't remember if we heard this last time we were here. Called in a few favors, maybe even stayed up a few nights. I wasn't sure I could pull it off, but everything's in order, and your daughter leaves for Thessia tomorrow. Yay! We'll travel with her to ensure she reaches her relatives back on the- Yay! Yes, I do remember this, actually. That's awesome. What a great person to do that for her. Do, 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 do. Boop. Spectre terminal. Let's go. Dun, dun, dun. Boop. Ooh, here we go. Private Talavi has requested a transfer to a unit actively engaged against Reaper hostels. A note from Sergeant Olembi says that Private Talavi is an exceptional engineer recommending her for duty on a team set to sabotage Reaper processing centers. Spectre authorization would fast track this request. Sure. Commendation, Captain Riley. Captain Riley, an N7 operative, has been nominated for a commendation for Valor for her actions at Scion. Approval from a Spectre would fast track the award process. Yeah, let's do it. Sweet. We got things and stuff. Ooh, war assets updated. Yes. And Spectre requisitions, boop. So let's get some mission items that I missed. Oh, the heating stabilizers. Interesting. So it's the heating stabilizers, the fragment, and the jamming tech, because I think everything else is weapons I can buy. So let's pick these up. Boop. Boop. And boop. All right. So yeah, I picked up all the things I can pick up from quests that I missed, because, you know, sometimes you miss things. Let's look at the map again. 
Ah, so now at the embassy offices, we have the Asari war strategist. So let's pop over there first. I have stuff to turn in. Woo! Wee! This way direction. I didn't see anyone. Dun, 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 dun. Oh. Hello. They should be right here. It says I should be able to turn it in right here, but there's nothing there for me to boop. It's probably this Asari. So let's go to a different floor and come back. Now arriving at Puerta Memorial Hospital. Thank you. Boop! Excuse me. Yay! If you promise to be careful, I've got something for you. I got a present for you. Fragment. Yes, I can use this to try to predict their strategic processes. We might be able to save a few worlds with this, Commander. Thank you. Yay! We did a thing. We did a thing. We did a thing and save some people. We did a thing. We did a thing. Hi, Elcor. I love you. Can I have a hug? Thank you. Okay, so we have Dr. Cylon in the lab services at the hospital. I think that's something we can turn in. And then we have Celia in the courtyard. I guess we can go to the hospital next. I'm just going to go down the line with places that have things to turn in. Boop. Vector status recognized. Please select a destination. Okay. Wee. Hi, Jacob. Bye, Jacob. <laughs> I don't think he's going to have anything new to say, so it's it's fine. Good to see you, buddy. Boop. All right, there's a doctor somewhere around here. This guy, boop. Yes, General Corellius should make a full recovery. He's already awake and responsive. Oh, okay, I did that already. This way direction. Boop. Boop. I came across this treatment plant at a chemical plant. Yay! Treatment? What is... I've never seen this kind of process before. Huh, probably experimental. It's a long shot, but let's run some tests and see if it might work for our patient. Yay! Woohoo! One down, a couple more to go, I think. Yep, scrounged it myself. Definitely didn't just buy it from the Spectre terminal. Don't you judge me. <laughs> As much as I'd love to go to Purgatory next, we do also have somebody on the Presidium Commons, so let's go there next. Bye everyone! Oh my god, I really hope we can get these people some beds soon because that does not look comfortable. There's also like four rooms in here total. <laughs> it's not a very big hospital. Boop. No shade or anything, you guys are doing the best you can. Boop. <laughs> Hi Jacob, no time to talk, sorry, see you later dude, bye! <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's go to the commons. Hi everyone. I'm back. How's it going? It me. Oh, what happened here? Uh, is everyone okay? The Presidium Commons is wild, man. There's still stuff all over the floor. It's still on fire. The fire's still not out. <laughs> Clearly everything is in complete disarray, so, you know. The person I'm looking for- oh, excuse me ma'am, sorry, just ran straight into you. The person I'm looking for is in the courtyard. So let's go and see, there's still a lot of despair here. Are you guys gonna start cleaning this up? <laughs> it's not good for morale, you know, to just leave it in disarray like this. Hello? Hi! Oh, CSEC officer. Hello, sir. How are you? This guy. <laughs> Boop! I pulled this from a Geth jamming tower. Maybe you can use it. How the hell did you... Never mind. Don't ask questions. <laughs> I'll have my people run with this. When the war comes back here, maybe we can save more lives. That would be awesome. Yay! Also, you might want to move away from that. It does not look safe, like, at all. Down to the courtyard we go. Hello. Ah, oh, what a lovely view. Hey, can I stand here with you? Ah, oh, how beautiful. Oh, and then there's that. It's fine. What if I just reached over and held her hand? Ah. 
cute. Okay, bye. All right, someone has something I can turn in down here. Who is it? Who is it? Who has a thing? Hello. I missed it. I went too far. Hello. I have something for someone. I think. Oh no. Where is the person? Hello. I couldn't help but overhear your conversation. Maybe these heating stabilizer schematics could help. <laughs> it's amazing. The colonists, my sister, will be most pleased. Thank Yay. Oh, I love this Solarian's coloring, like the purple stripe. So cool. Thank you. Yay. Is there anything else left? Tactus. I think Tactus wasn't there before when I checked, so let's go to the docks. Hello. Hi. Let's do some more jogging, shall we? There's someone that I need to turn things into, and I'm gonna cut. Hi, Zaid. What's up, dude? So the guy is right where Kelly is. I mean, Felicia. <laughs> hey. Hi. Hey, is he able to evacuate or still Has anything changed? Any news? No, but well, they promised, right? Oh, sweetie. I feel so bad for that girl. <laughs> hey, Tactus. What up? I recognize you. You're Commander Shepard. Hi. And you must be Tactus. Heard the refugees consider you their leader. Yes. Someone needs to sort out this mess. Mm hmm. CSEC has tightened access to the Citadel, and we've got desperate people down here with no place to go. I also hear you need basic medical supplies. Dr. Chocolate spoke of a mutually beneficial trade. Oh, we're helping Dr. Chocolates. In my experience, the Alliance looks out for their own. Mm. Trust is a hard thing to come by these days. I don't blame him for feeling that way. I know you need our military supplies, but they're worth far more than your basic meds. Her offer wasn't satisfactory. Okay. I appreciate him being honest. Take ours as a gift, you should reconsider. Ooh, should I give it to him as a gift or should I say do the right thing? Don't be a fool, <laughs> it's the other choice. So let's lay on the guilt <laughs> to these refugees who have nothing. <laughs> oh, I feel so bad like pressuring these poor refugees. But I'll say do the right thing. Your people need our supplies, and my people need every edge we can get. Your combat-grade meds will make a difference. And our mission may just save everyone. Now's not the time for pettiness or mistrust. Wow, she's we really laying it on thick. Today worries. It's easy to forget we are all in this together. You know, like starving. I'll have contact <laughs> yours. You'll have your supplies as soon as possible. Okay. Cool. Oh, I got Paragon points for that. Dr. Chocolates is going to be... We're very pleased. Felicia! There's so much desk. Hi! Everyone is staying civil. It gives me hope. Bye, Felicia. I mean, for someone who is mostly playing Paragon lately, I don't feel like I've been making very Paragon decisions. <laughs> it's like executing someone and then now I've just pressured refugees into giving me their resources. I'm I'm feeling pretty evil today. I don't know how to feel about it. <laughs> I mean, at least it is an exchange. It's not like I'm just like, give me your supplies. I feel like we're at least giving them something as well. We should be finding them housing and giving them, you know, more food and jobs. But you know what? I guess we have to start somewhere, right? <laughs> I think that's everything, unless we want to go to Purgatory and do some clubbing real quick before we get to this very high octane mission that we're about to do. I also kind of just want to go to Purgatory and run in circles and then leave. Boop. Vector status recognized. Please select a destination. Is there a renegade option to shoot the... Areas tagged of interest. <laughs> the box with the voice coming out of it. Thank you. I need to do some light clubbing. And by clubbing, I mean jogging around the club and then leaving. Also, Arya is here. So I want to see how she feels about all that that we went through. Boop. Because it was a lot. 
Uh, it's the same song that they play 24 hours a day because the party don't stop at purgatory. Boop. Yo, what up, kids? I'm back. I'm here to run up and down the stairs. You know what it is. I'm shocked that I can hear anybody's conversations over this music. I wish that everyone who was talking was scream yelling. <laughs> hey, what are you guys talking about? I'll pass on the word. I think you should finish your drink. Yeah, I think I should. Cool. Hey, guys. Uh. Uh. Here we go. All right, let's do some dancing. Boop. Yes. Ooh, get it. <laughs> Yay. Aria. What's up, girl? How are you in two places at once? I'm not going to ask. Boop. It seems the galaxy can't keep us apart. I know. Since we took back Omega, I've been consolidating my resources for the war. It's a little easier to coordinate from here. Cool. So unfortunately, I'll be slumming it on the Citadel for the time being. I think she the has a body double. Blood pack and Eclipse are in my pocket. I'll send them to war when you're ready for them. Yes. On your mind. Ooh, let's see. Ooh, let's ask Blood Pack. Are the Blood Pack falling in line? With Grill in charge? Where all systems go. Yes. It's his voice, but my words. Couldn't have asked for a better puppet. <laughs> the Blood Pack have committed 2,000 Vorcha to the cause. They'll make up the bulk of the army. Okay, cool. Blue Suns. Is Darner Boss cooperating with you now? Getting General Araka off the Blue Suns back did the trick. Voss still thinks he'll be getting me on mine. Idiot. But he's committed his veteran <laughs> soldiers to me. In turn, I commit them to you. Okay. Eclipse. What have we gained by having the Eclipse at our disposal? A ton of mechs and elite troopers for stealth operations. Sane has turned out to be more malleable than Jonas Sedaris ever was. My okay. control of Eclipse runs even deeper than I expected. You surprised me by taking such agency in the matter. Oh, did I? I'm full of surprises. My new task what force. Exactly have I acquired? Give me the rundown. Dirty to do the things your respectable militaries won't do. Eclipse Max and Vorchum okay. are excellent candidates for vanguards in any ground offensive. Well worth the little song and dance I had you perform, I'm sure. <laughs> song and dance. That was hours of my life. All right, last but not least. Omega. How's that going? People understand the first order of business is showing up defenses. No one wants another invasion. So they're enduring valiantly, not that they have a choice. Once again, I am Omega. Well, um, I'm glad you got what you wanted and thank you so much for all the reinforcements. We need as many as we can get. Uh, good luck with all that. Not much seems to have changed. I should get going. We'll talk later. <laughs> See ya. I'm sure. I'm sure. Bye, Aria. You want to dance? You want to have a drink? No, you're just going to sit there menacingly. That's fine, too. Yes. Oh. That picture. Oh, my God. It's so intense. I've got to say hi to these two. Look at them. Oh, it's the same conversation. Oh, Asla's chaps lady keeps interrupting their conversation. Excuse me, ma'am. Oh, I thought they'd have something new to say. That's okay. You guys are adorable. I love you. Kisses. Ah, so glad I've been able to come to my favorite club and run laps and yell at everybody. Now I feel prepared to take on the Reapers again. But before we go, just a little more dancing. More.
Yes! Perfect way to blow off some steam. I'm pleased. You know what? I'm gonna have a drink before I go. Boop. For Nyrene! Purgatory, bless you. When things are tough, when the Citadel is literally crumbling around you, you don't stop. The music doesn't stop, the party doesn't stop. We love Purgatory. Ah, another successful night at the club. I'm pleased. Good night, everyone. I'll be back. Okay, I think we're ready. It's time. The Purgatory party never stops in here. Thank you. Wee. Like Goodbye, everyone. I'm going to uh, take on the Reapers uh, that are controlling the Geth. I'm sure everything's going to be fine. Um, someone try to start cleaning up the Citadel, please, for morale. That would be great. <laughs> Let's go. Boop. Dr. Shock was sent word she'd like to speak with you. That's weird. I'm not hearing Trainer speaking to me. Makes me very sad. All right, let's go see Dr. Chocolates before we go. Dr. Chocolates. Hello, darling. Boop. I bullied a bunch of refugees for you. I hope you're happy. You always pull through, Commander. We've received the supplies from Tactus. Ooh, my reputation Indeed. went up. Indeed. We've acquired some very useful equipment. As such, I've been able to enhance the effectiveness of our Medigel delivery systems. Yay! Related information that Liara may find of interest. Check with Cliff. Okay. Ooh, Medigel upgrade efficiency increase. Yes, love it. Hey, it's that guy. <laughs> All right, let's go see Glyph. Boop. Have we heard from Agent Detrace yet? Hello, darling. Reported in for over eight hours, Doctor. She was stationed on Valchir when the Reapers invaded. Uh oh. I think we can assume what happened. Inform Agent Calamus he's now in charge of reporting Reaper activity past the Loas relay. Hello, Glyph. How are you? What did I get? Med Bay surgery. Okay. Let's see. Heal scars, health bonus. I'm going to improve my health. Boop. Yay! I got a thing. I got a thing. Hello, darling. Thanks for coming by. <laughs> No, nothing, nothing. You know, I love our relationship, Liara. I love how we can just talk for hours. And by talk, I mean stand there in silence. Okay, sweetie, love you, kisses, bye. Please enjoy your day. Thank you, Glyph talks to me more than her. Oh, that's okay, hi. Ah, <laughs> boop. Before we head out, let's take a look at the journal. Do, 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 do. Here we go. Priority Rannoch. The Reaper base controlling the Geth has been located, but jamming towers prevent conventional orbital bombardment. Land on Rannoch and use a prototype targeting laser to enable the Normandy to destroy the Reaper base. I almost feel like Liara is not a great romance choice because in 3 she's so busy and overwhelmed. I felt like I've had no time with her at all. Hello, trainer. I'm nervous. It's going to be fine. Can you provide me with a paper bag so I can breathe into it the whole time I'm traveling there? Thank you. That would be great. All right. Are we ready? Let's go to the map. Goodbye, Citadel. I will see you sometime in the future, I'm sure. To the mass relay! Boop. All right, Priority Rannoch, where you at? Do, 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 do. Oh, here it is, Perseus Vale, all the way at the corner of the map. It really had to be all the way out here, didn't it? <laughs> all the way out on the edge. I'm sweating, let's go. Boop. Everyone stay calm, don't panic. Scream internally, do whatever you need to do, it's absolutely fine. Oh my god, ah! Nervous donuts, 
You know, I think I need to just gradually do some donuts around this mission until I'm ready to land. Okay, there's the migrant fleet, Geth debris field. Oh, wow. Okay. Who's ready to be anxious? Rannoch, let's go, man. Let's do it. Boop. Back to Rannoch we go. Let's land. So it looks like Tali is auto-selected, so that's one squad member ticked off. Question is, who in the world am I going to bring on this mission? I mean, Garrus is, you know, Tali's friend from Mass Effect 1. Uh, Caden's also from Mass Effect 1 and beyond. We could bring Liara. I honestly don't know who to bring for this. Okay, so I think the ones I want to narrow it down to are probably Garrus, Liara, or Edie. Yeah, uh, let's go with Garrus. Okay. I think I'm okay with what I was using last time. Let's check. Ooh, Garrus has a new snipey. Ooh. Do I want to give Garrus the javelin? I think I bought this for him. I could be wrong. I think I'll stick with this one. Tali, I think I'm okay with what I had her using last time. Okay, Shepard has 10 points I can use. I'm going to level up incendiary ammo to rank five, increase ammo capacity by 30% or increase headshot damage by 25. I'm gonna do ammo capacity. Yep. So I have five points remaining and I only have two things I can do after this and they cost six points. So moving on to Garrus, me boy. Garrus has 14 points. I'm gonna level up Overload to rank five, incapacitate weaker organic enemies for a short duration, increase recharge speed by 25. I'm gonna do recharge speed. And then I'm going to level up Concussive Shot to rank six. We have power concussive shot with the properties of the active ammo power, enabling it to burn, freeze, disrupt, warp, or pierce armor, or increase damage to organics by 100% over 10 seconds, increase force by 50%. I think I'm gonna increase the force. Tali, my darling, has 10 points. I'm going to level up defense drone to rank five, increase drone's attack rate by 50%, or increase damage by 100%, increase attack range by 60. I'm going to do the second one. Everything else costs six points, so I can't level anything else up. It's happening. It's happening. I'm just going to do it. I'm going to do it. Boop. I <sighs> Legion. a line of sight. What's the fastest route? The upper entrance. Target the base before the Geth can organize resistance. Okay. What about you? We will deactivate defense systems and acquire an escape vehicle. Nice. You can do that? This unit still carries remnants of the old machine upgrade code. We can break any Geth security. Whoa. Whoa. I didn't know that. I did not know that was a thing they could do. No, it's okay. I trust Legion. You know your limits. I trust you. Yeah. I'm more concerned you didn't tell me about the upgrades. <laughs> you were tolerant of our recovery of Geth intelligences from the server, but this matter is different. Personal. You were ashamed. Shame is an emotional or cognitive response to societal judgment. Oh. It should not apply here. I'm on your side here, Legion. I want to help your people. <laughs> it's so sad. I intend to cause event. Oh. How do we get here? They get there better than this. They look so ashamed. No, based on empirical evidence, they are not. <sighs> yeah, she's like, sure, I guess. Proceed to the upper entrance. We will exit here and procure an escape vehicle. Okay. Got it. Legion. Good luck. Be careful, please. Hi, Garrus. Garrus, will you hold my hand? please. Hi, Tali. There's my girl. Love you, sweetie. 
I can't believe it. I don't think it's really sunk in She's yet. on the home the world. world. My world. She made it. Look at the sky. And the rock formations. They used to write poems about them. Oh, bless. This is such a big moment for her. Oh. And they will again. When we're done, maybe you'll write a new one. This is Ranok, the world of our ancestors. Our bodies carried the seeds that spread the desert grass. You've heard me say Kilasalai. Mm -hmm. The best translation I can come up with is by the home world I hope to see someday. Looks Aww. like you're saying it today. The living room window will be right here. <laughs> Something I should know. I just claimed the land. I know it doesn't mean much. <laughs> but when this is over, I'll have a home. Guarian spent Aww. centuries as nomad. You think you can go back to living in one place? That's a huge adjustment. We're used to carrying our homes around with us. a start. I have a rock. <laughs> oh, bless. Here we go. Oh, we're getting right into it. Sick. All right, let's go, kids. Woo! I'm shocked I can reach from here. Charge! Boom! All right, kids, let's get it. Ooh, who is shooting at me? Rude as hell. Let's go. Hi. The jamming towers are interfering with your signal, Commander. I'm compensated to keep you patched in. Boom. Good work, trainer. Oh, get down. <laughs> Did you see that frozen gas just fall over in the background? <laughs> that was amazing. <laughs> Hello. Bye-bye. Look at that guy standing over there, <laughs> minding his own business. <sighs> Don't touch Tali and Garrus. Nope. It's a bad gas. You must climb to the upper level before Geth units can fortify their positions. Okay. We're on our way. Let's I'm go. Is it in here? The heavy fleet has a clear path. Fall forward. Okay. Death fighter presence is negligible. Push Bye, on. Auntie. We Bring love you. And engage. All right. Um. Oh. Upper entrance. Can I go up here? Now we have to go around. Let's see. How do I get up there? Am I supposed to go this way? Her entrance. No, I don't think I can get there from here. Dun, 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 dun. Probably supposed to go up here. Boop. Up we go. Let's get it. Come on, Shep. Let's go. So many things to climb. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay. Up we go. Hello. Whee! <laughs> So fun. Oh! I love freezing. Oh my god, I love freezing them from here. It's so good. Hello. Charge! Don't touch me, you're rude. Boom. Oh! Oh my god. Jeez. Okay, Shepard, can I pick things up without doing a front flip? That would be chill. <laughs> hey, Garrus. What's up, boo? Come on, Tali. Let's go, sweetie. Let's roll out. Do, do. With my homies, roll out. Do, do. Upper entrance. All right, let's keep climbing, I guess. <laughs> I love this unconventional route that we're taking to get there. It's pretty awesome. Hello. I'm going to charge you. Smash. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> I will honestly never get over them shattering into a million pieces. Excuse me, who is throwing balls of flame at me? I don't appreciate it! You're rude as hell and I don't appreciate your sass. Excuse you! Someone's up there skulking around. Can you not? Come on, kids! Come on. We need to get inside before they send reinforcements. Okay, okay, we got it, we got it, we got it. No, Shepard. <laughs> oh, Shepard's trying to get a career in parkour, I swear. Oof, boop. Ding dong, your pizza's here. Boop. Okay, um, that's not good. Who wants a pizza of doom? Boom. Bye bye, Tata. Ta. Damn, did it take hours to punch with that shield? Oh no. Oh, you know, I don't appreciate all this. Can you actually not? Thank you. That would be great. Morgeth dropping in. Charge. Morgeth for me to charge. Bye bye. Let's go. Oof. Hello, I see you over there. What are you doing? Hi. Whee! Boom. Bye bye. Ooh. Hi. Nope. Bad guess. Get out of my way. Uh oh. Ooh. You know, that's very rude. I don't appreciate that. I really should stop getting hit in the face with missiles. I think that would like help me do better. Oh, <laughs> rip to that guy. <laughs> he flew. Can I get them from here? Oh no. I thought I could. Whee! <laughs> Oh, Legion. We'll get through. Are you okay? What's your status? The old machine's upgrades grant us targeting superiority. Okay. Hostile fire from your position. Okay. Keep it up. We'll get to the blast shield controls. I know Legion's on our side, but Reaper code? No, Legion's on our side. Never thought I'd hear you say that. Wow. That's huge for her. Having big breakthroughs already. All right. Garrus, Tali, I love you both. Let's keep going. Boop. Hello. Ding dong, your pizza's here. Boop. Thank you for the med kits. We've got death frigates inbound on the civilian fleet. Car is here. Civilian defenders are on intercept course. Oh no. Okay, boop. Let's get in there. Override. Okay. We. Oop. I actually help you? Oh! Don't touch me, fool. Survive. <laughs> it just says survive. Oh no. That's very ominous and foreboding. Garrus, Tali, where are my squad mates? Oh no. Where did they go? Where are my teammates? Oh, no, no, no. Uh-oh. Hi. Bye-bye, Tata. I don't see my squad mates. Did they go ahead or something? Hi. Don't touch me. Bye. You're rude as hell. Garrus, Tali, where are you guys? I... Pretty sure I'm soloing this because I don't see them anywhere and I can't go back through the door. So bye bye. Oh no 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 no. Come a little closer. Hi. Don't touch me, you rude as hell. Oh there they are. Hey guys. Oh no. That was bad. <laughs> I thought they weren't gonna be here for the whole thing. Oh. Hello! Oh, so relieved to see you guys. Alright, so now where do we go? Hello? Boop. Hello? 
Oh, you're rude. Boom. Bye bye. Can you actually not? That's extremely rude. Boop. Okay. Open the blast shield doors. Ooh, nice. Good. We'll be back out in a minute. Negative. The path behind you has been sealed. Oh. Nearby elevator can take you to the upper level. Okay. From there, you should have an acceptable line of sight for targeting. Cool. Sounds good. Let's go. Oh. 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 Whoa. Hello, Death Prime. How are you? Oh my God. Oh. Bruh. Oh God. The patrol fleet has broken the gas flank. Permission to pursue. Oof. Good hunting, Ron. Ron, be careful. Garrus, Tolly. Let's go, darlings. Oop. Oof. Oh, hello. There's another <laughs> Gap Prime over there. They really don't want us up here. Yep. Oh, God, there's a bunch of them. No, I don't want it. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's fun. Don't touch Garrus. Awesome. <laughs> awesome. Damn. <laughs> Okay. Anything from the base? No. The old machines have not registered us as a threat. We recommend haste. The creator fleet will be overrun unless you suffer the Geth connection to the old machine soon. Okay, okay. We gotta get through. Centuries in the making. To see it finally end. We'll get it done. Wow. Look at that. Alright, let's go to the ledge. systems are ready to sink to your target. I recommend you withdraw to a safe distance. Target the base? There we go. God. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh, my God. oh my God. Run. Run. How are we supposed to fight that thing? With great difficulty. <sighs> oh my God. Oh, yes. Oh my God. Holy crap. Blah. <laughs> oh no. We will attempt evasive maneuvers. Oh no. Oh my god. I'm just gonna keep shooting at it. Okay, let's go. <laughs> oh! What are we hit? The firing chamber. Looks like a 
weak point when it's priming. Damn it. The jamming towers have us targeting manually. Ooh. Don't make a precision shot. We may escape before it recovers. No. Pull over. Oh, no. What am I doing? Wait, the get stand or reaper control and the quarians are dead. This ends now. Edie, patch the quarry into the Normandy's weapon system. I want the targeting laser synced up to the whole damn fleet. Oh my god. Understood. Do you need assistance? Just stay down, Legion. I'll take it from here. Shepard Commander. Good luck. Acknowledged. Uh, what? Shepard to fleet. I'll take <gasps> the weak spot. Link up with the Normandy and be ready to fight. Oh my god, are you kidding me? There we go. I couldn't tell if it was dying, if it was shooting for me. Okay, I gotta do that again. Roll! It's not aiming at it. What the hell? Okay. This is interesting. Let me keep trying. I'm pointing the, the laser at it. Why can't I hit it? I keep aiming it at the thing and it doesn't do anything. Face to face with a bois. I'm releasing the shoot and nothing's happening. There we go. There we go. Okay, I'm getting the hang of it now. Bois. I'm getting the bois. Oh, no, 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 no. No. There we go. Yes. Any more? <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Can I help you? Oh my god! Oh! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh my god! I thought it was gonna 
incinerate me. My God. Wah. Bye bye. Ta ta. Goodbye, Bois. It was a good battle. You fought valiantly. Kick. <laughs> Dang, that's huge. You know who I am? Can I help you? You resist, but you will fail. The cycle must continue. Whoa, that voice. Whoa, I was not expecting this exploded reaper to talk to me. Help us understand. What are you talking about? We stopped what? Sovereign and the Geth. We stopped Harbinger it's and the It's speaking to me. We've earned a straight answer. <laughs> Try me, buddy. We might surprise you. <laughs> you represent chaos. We represent order. Oh, the voice. It's reverberating. Oh my god. You're killing everyone in the galaxy to save us? The cycle must continue. There is no alternative. Can you tell me why? But Organics and synthetics don't have to destroy each other. The battle True. for Ramok disproves your assertion. Okay, fair. Finish your war. We will be waiting. We did it. We killed a Reaper. Kila. We oh can my that the god. We're no being directed by the old machines. We are free. You did it, Shepard. Oh my god. We need to stop firing. They're completely vulnerable. We did it. Shepard Commander, the Geth only acted in defense after the creators attacked. Do we deserve death? What are you suggesting? Our upgrades. With the old machine dead, we could upload them to all Geth without sacrificing their independence. You want to upload the Reaper code? That would make the Geth as smart as when the Reaper was controlling them. Yes, but with free will, each Geth unit would be true intelligence. We would be alive, and we could help you. Our fleet is already attacking. Uploading the code would destroy us. Shepard, you can't choose the Geth over my people. Do you remember the question that caused the creators to attack us, Talizora? Does this unit have a soul? Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, so we have to choose whether or not to allow the Geth to have free will or to let them die. Of course I want to choose Tali because she's my girl, but like at the same time, I also don't want all these Geth to die. Does this unit have a soul? Oh man, this is such a hard decision. I either have to side with the Corians or side with the Geth. I mean, I don't want to let all these Geth die. I really don't. Oh, this is such a huge decision that's so ambiguous because it's like, while I trust Legion and I want to believe them, I can see why the Quarians like have concerns about letting this happen because installing them with Reaper technology is like really scary and they will have free will, right? So who knows how some of them are going to react versus others. But I mean, the Geth were, some of the Geth were attacking us to begin with. So I feel like it won't be much different. It is hard because as much as I don't want the Geth to die, I also don't want to feel like I'm betraying Tali. And that's what's that's what's really hard is like, I'm hoping that Tali will understand, whereas a bunch of Geth will just die and that'll be it. 
I have faith in Legion. I also have faith that if I do this, Tali will come to understand my choice. I want to go with my instinct, but I'm also like, I don't know what's going to happen. Because <laughs> either way, I'm going to upset somebody, but upsetting the Geth means letting a bunch of them die. My instinct is to upload the code. From what I learned in the Geth hive mind, the Quarians essentially caused this to happen, right? And I don't want anything bad to happen to the Quarians, but I feel like I also want to give the Geth a chance to make decisions for themselves. I mean, we are uploading them with Repo technology though, which feels a bit counterintuitive, but at least it gives them an option to choose for themselves. I'd rather try that than just kill a bunch of them, especially since we've come so far in discovering that a lot of the Geth didn't want this. And so far, quite honestly, Legion hasn't really given me any reasons not to trust them. They've kind of cooperated through this whole thing. And while we can't control what every Geth is going to do, it's kind of like human beings having free will, right? We can't dictate or control what every person's gonna say and do. I feel like uploading the code is a chance to do something different. I feel like that is what has led the Geth to trusting me is being like, I'm doing things differently. I'm not trying to get a bunch of you killed. I'm not just getting rid of you because you were corrupted by repo technology and here you are. I'm trying to do things differently to change the future. And I feel like just letting a bunch of them die will just be being like, no, I don't care, just kill them. If I actually give them a chance, there's more likelihood that they will side with us. We're breaking cycles of generational trauma, okay? That's what we're doing today. It's so hard because like the people pleaser in me is like, I don't want Tali to be upset. I don't want my friend to be upset. I don't want the Koreans to be upset, but I have to go with my instincts. I have to. I mean, this feels so heavy. It's so easy to just boop the button and pick something, but it's a huge decision. It's huge. I think I'm gonna upload the code. Oh, I really hope I don't regret this. Upload the code. Upload the code to the Geth. Tally, call off the fleet if you can. Uploading. 10%. This is Admiral Talizora. All units, break off your attack. Belay that order. Continue the attack. Girl, again. 20%. This guy. I beg you, do not do this, please. We regret the deaths of the creators, but we see no alternative. 40%. Oh, we can still stop them at this point? Rally the fleet, warn the fleet, stop Legion, allow the upload. What if I just changed my mind at this point? Okay, all right. Well, we have enough Paragon points, so I'm going to say... Uh, Oh God, rally the fleet. No, nobody else dies today. That's it. Legion, keep going. Nobody else dies Shepherd. today. All ships, this is Commander Shepard. The Reaper is dead. Stand down. Oh, I hope I'm this doing the right Admiral thing. This is Shepard speaks with my authority. And mine as well. Negative, we can win this war now. Keep This fire. guy. 60%. The Geth are about to return to full strength. If you keep attacking, they'll wipe you out. Stop attacking, please. Entire history is you trying to kill the Geth. You forced them to rebel. You forced them to ally with the Reapers. Stop attacking them, please. 80%. The Geth don't want to fight you. If you can believe that for just one minute, this war will be over. Please. Choice. Please. Kill us alive. All units, hold fire. Oh my god. Oh my god. Error. Copying code is insufficient. Direct personality dissemination required. Shepard what? Commander, I must go to them. I'm... I'm sorry. What? It's the only way. What? Legion. The answer to your question was yes. I know, Tally. What? But thank you. Where is he going? Kilo Where are they going? Kilo select. <gasps> oh! What? Oh no! Commander. No! Admiral 
Ron. I heard your ship made a crash landing. Glad you got out in one piece. I was listening over the radio. If oh, no! He did. We have taken heavy losses. I don't know if we can. No. You are welcome to return to Rannoch at Moran with us. Oh, Legion? No, Legion? I'm sorry, Commander. Legion sacrificed itself to give us all intelligence. Oh. It will be honored. Good. And we will honor Legion's promise. The Geth fleet will help you retake Earth, and our engineers will assist in building the Crucible. As will ours, of course. Admiral, had you considered possible settlement sites? Oh, no. The southern continent had excellent farmland, as I recall. Are you gonna be okay? No. I believe so, Commander. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, no. <laughs> Shopping for another house? Beachfront property. Claim it fast. It's a buyer's market. <sighs> Legion! You okay? No! <laughs> no working with the Geth will be difficult. I know you aren't asking, asking me. me. I'm coming with you. No, I'm not okay! <laughs> oh, Legion! I loved Legion. Why? Oh no. I wasn't expecting that. Oh, it's like Morden. They made such a noble sacrifice. And it was even more emotional. Like right after Legion dropped, that a huge <laughs> Geth came up to the Corians and were like, we'll help you. And it was like, oh my god, it worked. And it was amazing that Tali and Legion got to have that moment together at the end. I'm so sad. I was like, yay, we got through it and nobody died <laughs> right at the end. I know they did it so quickly. It was like, okay, well, I gotta do what I gotta do. Bye. <laughs> so quick. That's right, Legion did say I right at the end. So that means we turned into I. And then Tali answered Legion's question with yes. This unit does have a soul. <laughs> so first of all, oh my god, we just ended a centuries old war. <laughs> like, what? I feel like I've just broken the cycle, like, for so long this has been going on. And now that got so close there. Can you imagine, like, if we hadn't have stopped that general? Oh, it could have been so bad. Now Tali's saying she's not staying, she's coming with me. I have to say, like, Legion was one of my favorite... Legion was one of my favorite characters in the trilogy so far. And it just makes me really sad that they're gone, but I'm so proud that he made that sacrifice. Just the Geth and the Corians talking to each other and discussing rebuilding. It's really cool to see. It's, it's amazing. Well, <laughs> we got through that. I will never be over losing Legion. Thank you for your sacrifice. Okay. <laughs> now that I've pulled myself together a little bit. Tali, I'm not staying, I'm coming with you. Wait, that's not why I came. I'm gonna ask. I think you've earned a few favors with the fleet. I'm asking them to launch an assault on the Reapers. Figure that makes us even. If the Reapers were going to stay on Earth, sure. But sooner or later, they'll come to Rannoch. We did just kill one of them. So I'm coming with you to stop them. If you think I can help. Tali's coming with us. I'd love for her to come with us. I mean, as much as I'd love for her to build her new house, her home is probably going to be under attack fairly soon. So I get where she's coming from. If you're certain. I'm sure about this. Yeah. I Yay, Tali. This picture of hope and peace. 
And all I see is everyone I've lost. My team on Hastrum, my father, even Legion. Oh. I'm mourning again. How crazy is that? It's not crazy at all. It is beautiful, though, isn't it? Yeah, it is. It'll be years before we can live without our suits completely. But right now... Right now... Stop! This. Oh, come on! <laughs> Understand you've helped resolve the situation with the Geth. I'm not yes. listening to you. I Two. oh come on. I've read the reports. You ended a war three centuries in the making. How oh, long? I got all excited. The remaining Geth. As best we can tell, they are Geth bodies loaded with Reaper code. But they are just a tiny fragment of the full Geth fleet. You've done the impossible, Commander. And I may be able to provide help of my own. I've received information from my government. It's too sensitive to discuss over an unsecured channel. Okay. If I come to the Citadel. Yes, oh, I was just there. <laughs> I'll be waiting for you in Councillor Udina's office. Wait, it's not his office anymore. He's dead. Order. Admiral Hackett's available on Bitcoin. Okay, thank you, trainer. <sighs> How could they do that? How could they show Tali taking off her mask and then not show her face. Come on. Oh, I can't believe that. It was so interesting that when she took off her mask, her voice changed. Oh, that was so cool. Oh, I hope I get to see it sometime. Maybe, potentially. Let's just do it while we're here. Hello. Oop. <laughs> Commander, something on your mind? Hi, how's it going? I guess we could say, Galactic readiness? What's our state of readiness, Admiral? Given the situation everywhere else as close as we can be, you've done well, Shepard. Nice. Okay, I like forces. The extra help we picked up along the way? Bringing in both the Quarians and the Geth has helped us immeasurably. The Quarian fleet is providing evac and fire support, while the Geth attack Reaper supply lines. Uh, Krogan and Turians. The Turians and Krogan. The Krogan and Turians have obviously been a big help. Or not Rex running the show is a bonus for us. Rexy poo. And the female Krogan you rescued is rallying more support from the other clans. Our queen, I'm glad love her. Disabled that mom and Tachanka. We could have lost a lot of Krogan support as it is. We picked up some Turian troops. Good to hear. Cool. Arya's reinforcements. What about Arya's mercenaries. Arya Talok, there's someone I never thought we'd be in bed with. <laughs> Looks like we are. Useful and violent. Mostly Vorchai here. Mm -hmm. Put the blue suns to good use. Intel says Narnir Vosk is bringing his men, and that they're gunning for a fight. The Eclipse are providing troops and mechs. When we find a Reaper soft There's spot, a lot of those dudes. Don't want to know how nice. you got Arya's cooperation, <laughs> but whatever you did, it was worth it. He's like, I don't need to know that information. Uh, let's say Reaper progress. Reaper situation? I it's killed one. Well. Even it's if pretty you did great. Buy some time. Our threat projections show the Reapers will gain the advantage on most other fronts. Oh no. And now the Asari are a prime target. They're the most advanced race in the galaxy. We'll soon <laughs> find out if that means anything. I'm sure we will. Why pick me? I what? Mean, Admiral, I have a personal question. Didn't I ask this Speak already? Really, Commander. Why me? Why put me in charge of all this? I need reinforcements. <laughs> Soldier in this whole damn navy who knows how to kill reapers. I've had practice. I've had some practice, even success, but does that qualify me for this? Your dossier says it does. <laughs> Your dossier you does. Cruise all those years ago, and you were the only one to make it out alive. Back then, I saw more than just a soldier in the making. That was enough. And because of that, you think I qualify to save the galaxy? Shepard, let me tell you. Main character. You can pay a soldier to fire a gun. You can pay him to charge the enemy and take a hill. But you can't pay him to believe. I don't follow, sir. When you went up against Sovereign, there was no good reason to believe you'd win. But your crew didn't seem to care. They went along anyway. 
Your trip through the Omega-4 relay? That was a suicide mission, if there ever was one. Yep. <laughs> yeah, there your crew was, standing beside you, proud to serve. Why? Because they believed in you, their leader. That's what I need now. Where we're taking them is liable to get pretty hairy, and I know you're the one who will get us to the other side. Okay, I guess that's everything then. I didn't see anything else new, so yeah, I think that's a, uh, I think that's a good enough reason. Okay, bye. Nothing more, sir. Hack it out. Bye. All right, next. Oh, that's where Legion <laughs> was. Boop. Sad boop. Hi. I mean, that's something. <laughs> Seriously. Dr. Chuck was sent word that she'd like to speak with you down in the med bay. Okay, trainer. I'm just gonna sad jog around the ship really quick for a minute. <sighs> Hi everyone, I'm back. I'm gonna be sad for a while. I'm sorry. Hi, Joker. Boop. Gotta hand it to you, Commander. That's the first time I've seen someone end a war by yelling. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't kill the Gath. After seeing what the Gath couldn't do it. Like, I figured they deserved a chance. I couldn't Thank do you, it. Commander. I doubt many organics would have trusted a synthetic race. And now we've got Aww. two fleets for the price of one. We didn't lose anybody. Except yeah. Legion. <laughs> before it sacrificed itself. Legion referred to itself as I instead of we. Yeah? So? The singular pronoun indicates Legion's independent personality had fully actualized. In its last moments, it was not an avatar of the Geth consensus. It was a person. That's what I figured. Well, when the Geth fleet helps us retake Earth, I guess we'll owe that to him. Hi, Edie. It's on your mind, Edie. I was just reflecting. The Quarians who stole oh, the man. not making the Geth enough like them. I'm not sure I understand. Units with networked intelligences will trend toward cooperation for mutual benefit. But units with central heuristics establishing an individual personality, such as myself, develop preferences. These preferences form attachments that keep my calculations from devaluing the worth of the lives aboard the Normandy. You're saying the Geth turned on the Corians because they aren't individuals? That huh. is my theory, but it is limited to a sample size of one society. Interesting. The only other notable synthetic society is the Reapers, and we do not know if they govern by consensus as the Geth do. Do me a favor, don't ask them. <laughs> Let's not find out, shall we? Thanks for the chuckle, kids. <laughs> Legion said I instead of we. Oh. Oh man, my heart. There's a new message at your private terminal. Thank you, trainer. Hello. I hear you were on the ground with the Reaper. Yep. He fired up at us a few times. It Joker was wild. Normandy through some insane maneuvers to stay out of the line of fire. It's hard being in a fight like that, especially mm -hmm. when you're not the one flying the ship. Joker's one of the best, though. He really I is. I was nauseous, swinging around in my safety harness. <laughs> but then I was furious, just <sighs> enraged. I wanted that thing dead. You didn't want the Reapers dead when they attacked Earth? I wanted them defeated. I wanted Earth saved. But I never wanted to physically tear them in <laughs> half and watch them blow up. Whoa. Congratulations, trainer. I believe you've discovered your fight or flight instinct. <laughs> I should have stayed with Chess. Although now I think I'm spoiled by the lack of explosions. Shep's like, something that I have to use frequently. Boop. Let's talk Korean War from Diana Allers. It may be hard to believe after what we just went through, but the rest of the galaxy is barely aware the Koreans ever went into the Vale, let alone started a war with the Geth. We're sitting on a major piece of history here. I have material from all the players except you. Can I get into your cabin for an hour and get your thoughts on vid? Diana. Progress report from Shalaran Vasranuk, Commander. With assistance from the Geth, our fleet is nearly back to full strength. We have focused most of our efforts on providing evacuation assistance and support for the Turian fleet while the Geth harassed the Reapers. Even with our newfound peace, it seemed foolish to risk an incident by putting our forces in closer proximity. 
I understand from Admiral Zen that the Crucible project continues well, though Zen herself seems dissatisfied with the technological capabilities of the device. Though eccentric, she is also brilliant. Hopefully she'll find some way to improve its functionality. I would never have believed you would talk Han down, Commander. Take care of Tali's aura for me. Kila Salai, Admiral Shalaran Vasranok. From Tali, Shepard, just wanted to let you know that I'm going to join Adams in Engineering. It seems like the best place for me to help, as long as I'm coming with you anyway. Please drop by when you have a minute. Tali! Yes! Let's go see Tali. That'll cheer me up. Boop. I didn't realize. I thought they'd been using that before. Maybe it's just because I've heard Rannoch a lot lately. They've been changing their names. That's so cool. Love it. Tali! Gabby, what do you think about our new yeoman, Miss Trina? She's not a yeoman. She's a communication specialist. Okay. You're barking up the wrong tree, Kenneth. You're not her type. <laughs> oh. Well, perhaps you should go and talk to her then. Maybe I should. Nobody's barking up my tree. <laughs> Sure to take video. Oh my god, really? <laughs> Tali! Hey Tali! Boop. Can't be. No. I guess that's right. Hi! She's back on the Normandy! Oh, sorry, I didn't hear you. Hi! I just got communication from the fleet. Sorry. Uh, from Rannoch. From Rannoch! I'd send any new technology I found back to the fleet. I should probably be doing that with the agriculture samples now. I don't know anything about raising crops. It's okay, How we'll learn. Doing? It's crazy. The Geth are helping, setting up housing, adapting power systems. Oh my god! In weeks, what would have taken us years. This is amazing. Uh, even uploading into the suits of Quarian volunteers. What? Rewriting environmental functions, jumpstarting our immune system. <gasps> You're kidding me. How can they do that? What? The Geth are software, not hardware. They can transfer themselves from a normal body into anything with enough processing power. What? They're mimicking infections, so the host can adapt without getting sick. It's like making a vaccine. You're kidding me. What? That's amazing. The won't have to wear those suits anymore. <gasps> it doesn't seem possible, but yes. In a few years, with Geth improvements, we won't- No way. We might still wear them. The suits have become part of our society. No way. A rupture won't be a death sentence. Today, on Rannoch, there are Quarian children who will grow up healthy and strong, thanks to the Geth. Oh they my god. Not. No. I'd have killed the Geth with no regrets. And I'd have been wrong. <sighs> Thank you. Wow. Oh, wow. I need a second to take that in. That is amazing. I did not know the Geth would be able to do that. I can't believe my people are working with the Geth. I can't believe that they're able to improve their immunity so that new children being born on Rannoch and current Corians may be able to, like, not wear suits anymore and have better immunity. Wow, Legion Sacrifice has changed so much, and I'm so glad I made that decision. Wow, I'm just like, I'm kind of shook. What an amazing outcome. Garrus, thank you for your help. I couldn't have done it without you. Boop. Hi, Garrus. Peace between the Geth and Quarry. I know, isn't it amazing? Not how I ever imagined that would turn out. And next you'll be telling me the Krogan and Turians are cooperating. Guess what? Oh, right. You meant that <laughs> You're a peacemaker, Shepard. A rare thing these days. Oh. Now, if you can pacify the Reapers, we'll make you a saint. I am so happy. Not sure if having an army of Geth behind oh. us gives me confidence or makes me feel like there's a target on my back. <laughs> I mean, I, I, okay, I can understand. Lame. All right, Garrus, thanks for your help, me boy. I appreciate you so much. We love you, best boy. Let's see if Liara has anything to say. Boop. Another Reaper gone, and peace between the Geth and Quarians. It's amazing. Isn't your girlfriend cool? People have a world to fight for. Something they know will last forever. Oh, Tali and Liara chatting. You and the Geth remain good neighbors. Mm -hmm. They're not our servants anymore. I'm 
not sure what we should call them. Allies? Friends. There's still too many wounds on either side. But maybe one day. I would love that. Boop. The migrant fleet and the Geth warships have joined Admiral Hackett. Hello, Shepard. <laughs> All right, sweetie. Um, well, love ya. Kisses, boop. <laughs> Private messages terminal has new correspondence. Okay, let's take a look. <sighs> oh, boop. Ooh. Email from Sergeant Kavanagh to Sergeant Ichi. Next time, I want you to warn me that the Geth are our friends and that maybe we're not supposed to shoot the big robots. I almost pissed myself when these problems started dropping out of the sky and mopping up the Reapers. We fired a few rounds at them until we realized they weren't firing back. Then this one comes over, said their allied assistants and asked for our status. I'm not complaining they saved my crew, but I'm never living down having to apologize to a Geth for shooting one of its cut one of its damn lights off. <laughs> Hilarious. Thank you. Bye. Should I go see Dr. Chocolates? Boop. Communication is important. You should probably let people know that the Geth aren't trying to kill them anymore. I like Dr. Chocolates. Shepard. Hello. Remember our agreement? We'd open a bottle of Cerise Ice Brandy every year. And it's my turn to buy. Oh. Well, it hasn't been a year yet. Yes. Well, something tells me we won't have the chance a few months from now. So, <laughs> indulge my impatience. Okay. Um. Uh. Save it for our Doctor, victory. Put that bottle in a safe place. We'll crack it open to celebrate our victory over the Reapers. Admire your optimism, and I'll look forward to the day we can share it. Till then. Okay. So. Udina finally went over the edge. <laughs> I never really liked the man. Now I know why. Oh, dang. It's nice to have Tally back. It I is, sure isn't it? I've stopped with dextro-based antibiotics and antihistamines. Oh, thank you. Hello. Hello. Yay! Boop. So nice to have Tally back. Let's go to the other end. Boop. Got the flush. Hey! Oh, James and Caden are playing! Caught it on the river. Shit. <laughs> Thought you were bluffing on the flush. Good for you. Cannon, Lieutenant. <laughs> Good for you. <laughs> yes, sir, Major Alenko, sir. <laughs> Look at these two. Hello. Hey, Commander. Hi. Shepard, I'd deal you in, but Vega just cleaned me out. Why am I not Come surprised? On, really as deep as your pockets go. <laughs> no sentimental crap stowed away. Investment. Sentimental crap. Some land on the Sunshine Coast I could put up. <laughs> I'll pass. Oh, these two. That was quite the negotiation you've pulled off. Thank you. Have both the Quarians and the Geth on our side? That's a very good thing. I cannot believe. Like, I... Uh, it hasn't fully sunk in yet, to be honest. <laughs> like, what is happening? Boop. You guys, I'm, I'm floating on a cloud right now. I can't believe what I just did. Cortez! In on me. Hi, are you okay? Ma'am. Ma'am? He's like hunched over the table. All right, everyone, as you were. Boop. Hello, Jarvik. How are you? Another Reaper has died. Yes. You are proving that humans are capable soldiers. But I question Thank you. this peace you are brokered. Uh-huh. No such thing is possible between machines and organics. I would have destroyed the synthetics without hesitation. Okay. And these quarians, let's just hope they are reliable allies. It is difficult to trust a species that hides behind masks. Okay, Javik, they don't have a choice, sweetie. It's that or they die. So they're not just doing it to look cool. You know what I mean? The only conflict you should concern yourself with is ending the one with the Reapers. That's what I'm doing. Diplomacy does not win wars. Powerful and plentiful firearms do. I need the firearms from lots of other people that I'm creating allyship with. That's how this works. Okay. It seems you believed Protheans built the mass relays. <laughs> the Reapers are cunning in their deception, allowing life to flourish, century upon century, letting us believe ourselves the masters of the cosmos. Then the truth becomes known. There are monsters in the dark spaces. And we are their prey. I mean, if 
that's the way that he has been raised in the society that he lived in was like power and enough firearms are what'll win. I'm like, well, I'm getting power and firearms from lots of different people because on our own, we can't do it. She looks like she was punching him. <laughs> she just gonna punch him in the back of her head. Do not care what others think. Do what you must. Oh, I will keep that in mind. Bye, Javik. See you later. <laughs> Let's talk to Diane while we're here. Diana, excuse me. Human leaders using military force on their own people. They oh, say it's no. to prevent loose cannons from provoking the Reapers. But are they indoctrinated? Oh, no. In the only place they can. The battle space. Oh, jeez. Hello. I'm doing a segment on the Gethquarian War. Hi. It should take maybe an hour. Can we talk in your cabin? Sure. Call me up when you're ready for that interview, Commander. All right. Boop. Let's wind down with an interview with Diana about my experience, and then I'll go to bed for like a week. Boop. <laughs> Trainer, can you send up Diana Allers? She wants to talk to me. She's on her way, Commander. Thank you, Trainer. That was quick. I'm sure you've got a million questions. Hi. I narrowed it down to 40. Let's see how you do with the top 10. Okay. Hi. It's me again, in my Commander, room. The last time most of us heard about Geth, they were attacking the Citadel alongside Sovereign. Okay. Yes, and you should know that was a minority of the Geth. Most of them are not hostile to organics. Is that how you explain that they're allies? And no longer dangerous robots who stick humans on spikes? deal with it. The Geth are misunderstood. What you have to realize is that despite their reputation, most Geth are not inherently violent. And there's a bigger picture here. The Quarians attacked them. The Geth fought back in self-defense just like any organic would. Now that we've freed the Geth from Reaper control, they'll want payback for their enslavement. But you're going to take an army of synthetics to fight Reapers with untold hacking abilities. Pretty What's much. keeping the Reapers from reprogramming the Geth like they have before? Good question. I can't predict that, but I guess the best I can say is the Geth have been upgraded? The Geth are extremely intelligent and they've put incredible thought into solving this problem. I miss Emily not Wong. Turn again. I'd bet my life on it. Oh. Okay. That's a strong now, statement. A question from a Batarian on Omega. Commander Shepard, if the mass relays can be destroyed... Oh. So did I miss anything? Do you have any questions? You gonna go file your story now? Well, if you don't mind. Go tell the galaxy what we've done. I could use some good news. Aye aye, Commander. <laughs> oh my. I wasn't expecting Shepard to make that strong of a statement. I was expecting her to just say they've been upgraded, it's the best I can tell you, but she was like, I bet my life on it. <laughs> I was like, whoa. Okay. That's fine, I guess. <laughs> How are we all doing? Are we okay? <laughs> First of all, Rip Legion. Your sacrifice is probably one of the most important decisions that have been made so far. And I was shocked at how quickly it happened. It was so quick. Legion just dropped to the ground. It was shocking. It is amazing that because of that sacrifice, Corians and the Geth are now working side by side and I thought it was going to be a way more drawn out process, but I'm so relieved we've ended the centuries long feud. It really hasn't sunk in. I'm feeling really good about where we're at now. We've made really good headway. I'm really wondering if at some point in the game we'll get to see the Corians like existing on Renok without their suits. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, while I'm so happy that we managed to achieve this, I'm so sad for Legion. And I wish that didn't have to happen, but his sacrifice had a huge impact. I think next time we'll go to the Citadel. I think the council wanted to speak to us about something. It's gonna take me a bit to get over this one. I would have loved to have seen Legion make it to the end with us. This was a tearjerker for sure. It's so bittersweet because what we were able to accomplish is amazing, but it came at the expense of Legion. So rip Legion, it's gonna take a long while for me to get over it. Thank you for your sacrifice.
thanks so much for joining me for Mass Effect 3. If you're enjoying this playthrough and want to see more, go ahead and let me know by hitting the thumbs up and leaving me a comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notifications button on your way out so you can be notified when new videos go up. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!